I used to sing in the church, in the choir, you know, with all the boys treble, you know, that sort of thing. And they, the, the priests, took us to see Mary Poppins, you know, as they, as, you know, I'm sure they do still now. And um, I was fascinated by what I saw, you know, this magic character, you know, this, this amazing, surreal, uh, larger than life, singing with such a beautiful voice. That devastated me, changed my life. Oh gosh, I want to, <laughs> I want to sing like that. I was 10 years old and uh, I was supposed to be singing. I, ha I was a soloist in, 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 in church, in the church choir. So I would step forward and sing my lovely, mm, my lovely little plain, um, praise the Lord, whatever it was in Italian or Latin. And I decided to add that little twist, you know, that little Mary Poppins cadenza. <laughs> Everybody just, you know, the congregation, the priests, everybody just thought it was... When you're a child and you sing um, as a boy treble and uh, you grow up and you love Julie Andrews, I think you've got two choices. You either grow up to be gay or to be a countertenor. I went for the double whammy and <laughs> became both. <laughs>